To me, it was very disappointing, the movie. Um, not necessarily his fault. So we had uh, people submit questions uh, for you on our social media platforms. Can I pick five of the best ones to uh, have you answer? Finally, I get a, a good question. You ready? Oh, yeah, I can hardly wait. OK, I can tell. You're really excited for our social media submitted questions on our YouTube channel. What was your meal plan while training? What kinds of foods were your cheat meals? Oh, I cheated on everything. Um, I was a big pretzels and beer guy or a little haagen you know, little ice cream guy if I was, you know, losing it. But, you know, I burned through a lot of calories, so it's not as if I was too concerned about that. You know, weight has not been my issue, so you got to feel that out. But um, those would be a couple of things that I enjoyed quite a bit. What do you think of the job Shia LaBeouf did in the movie about you and Borg? The, the, the best thing that it appeared that he did, and this may not be his fault, was the actual tennis part. So that was, would tell you that, to me, it was very disappointing, the movie. Um, not necessarily his fault. You know, I never spoke to him. Um, wasn't involved with it. And why was that? I tried to meet with the producers, because I said to Bjorn and I, we got to, you know, we should do it together or not do it. And it just never worked out. We never, I said, you know, that we don't have much money in the budget. I said, OK, don't pay us the money. Just give us some money if, you know, at the other end. Right. So you don't have to pay us right. any money, OK? Right. But, you know, if you're going to start trying to sell the district, you know, then that's where the, you, right. come on. Think you're, you're and on then, the back you know, oh, well, I don't know if we can, uh, forget it. Yeah. And, and, and it stinks. I was watching some of this stuff. It's not even true, some of it. So I guess it's a movie, so you try to be, you know, you're allowed to have certain licenses, I guess, or freedoms, even if it's not true. How was it working with Adam Sandler and Mr. Deeds? Well, uh, Mr. Deeds was you the did best. great in well, that. Thank by you. The way. We we had a lot of fun. That was, I thought all movies would be like that. And the next time I did one with Adam, it seemed like a no-brainer. At anger management, I'm like, this. Come <laughs> on. I mean, I got to be in this. And he was like, you know, you're right or whatever. And then it ends up by getting cut out of it basically. So I'm like, oh my God, how did that happen? Um, another one on the movie front, you're funny as hell in movies. Any aspiration to do non-cameo comedy? It, it would be nice, but I'm not, like, going auditioning for it. I, mean, I, I don't know if that's the play either. I don't think so. So I think my career may be nearing its climax. Hopefully there'll be something else. I don't know. All right, last one. Uh, you threw out a pretty good first pitch a while back at the Mets game. And you did. You nailed uh, yeah. it. Um, did you ever consider pitching? Well, I did pitch as a kid. I went through until I went to high school. And so I pitched. And then um, I went to, uh, I, you couldn't pitch every game. So then they put me in center field. And then not, not a single ball would go. You'd get out there, basically. So I said, I want to be a catcher. And then I, you know, I was a lefty catcher, so I thought, oh. Then I thought people ba sort of barreling towards it. I think, oh, I don't know about this one. And, um, but I like the idea of pitching, because it's sort of like controlling things. Although I'd like to be a hitter also. See, I want to be a pitcher that hits. I'd never figure out these pitchers that all they want to do is pitch. And I'm like, don't you want to go in there? And... But I mean, I, baseball, it's, it's too, sl it, Unless you're a pitcher or like the catcher, it's a little bit, not enough happening.